Hey everyone, let's talk about something millions of people use every single day, but there's still so much confusion around it. The birth control pill. Is it a miracle worker? Is it secretly dangerous? The truth is, it's complicated. So let's break down the real risks and benefits in three minutes. First, how does this tiny pill even work? It's not magic, it's science. Birth control pills contain synthetic versions of hormones your body already makes, usually a combination of estrogen and progestin. These hormones work together to stop your body from releasing an egg. That's called ovulation. No egg, no chance of pregnancy. It also thickens your cervical mucus to block sperm and thins the uterine lining. Now there are two main types. The most common is the combination pill, which has both estrogen and progestin. But if you can't take estrogen for health reasons, there's also the progestin-only pill, often called the mini pill. And here's the kicker. People take the pill for way more than just preventing pregnancy. It's a game changer for so many other issues. It can regulate unpredictable periods, significantly reduce acne, and make heavy, painful periods much lighter. It can even help manage conditions like PMS and endometriosis, and studies show it lowers your risk of certain cancers, like ovarian and endometrial cancer. Okay, but what about the side effects? Because yes, they exist. When you first start, it's common to experience things like nausea, breast tenderness, or spotting between periods. Some people report mood changes, but the evidence here is really mixed. It truly varies from person to person. A lot of these side effects often go away after your body adjusts in the first few months. Now for the serious stuff, you've probably heard about blood clots. This is a real but rare risk. The risk is highest for people who are over 35 and smoke or have a history of blood clots, certain types of migraines or high blood pressure. This is exactly why it's so important to talk to a doctor. They'll screen you for these risks to make sure the pill is a safe option for you. For most healthy people, the risk is extremely low. So what happens when you stop? Worried it'll mess up your fertility forever? Don't be. For most people, fertility bounces back almost immediately. You could get pregnant within just a few weeks of stopping the pill. In the long term, it's considered safe for most healthy individuals. Ultimately, the decision to take the pill is deeply personal. It can be an amazing tool for managing your health and your life, but it's not a one-size-fits-all solution. The best thing you can do is have an honest conversation with a healthcare provider. They can help you weigh the pros and cons for your body and find the right fit. Stay informed and take care.